These videos are brought to you by MSCCasino.com and the Maco Sporting Club. MSCCasino.com, check it out. You are watching Sports Matters TV. Okay, guys, Sports Matters TV, we're back in Liverpool. A massive weekend here at Fox, and as always in Liverpool, I'm joined by a man that I idolised, uh, Kevin Mitchell. First of all, Kevin, a big weekend. Uh, what's your thoughts on the main event and core main event, first of all? Do you know what? I know. Um they're both good kids. Um, both talented, talented, talented fighters. I haven't really looked into them so much. I've been so busy in the gym with my own fighters and I've been busy with what I'm doing, but I haven't really watched the main event really. I just know they're both very highly talented fighters and very good good kids, and that's what I know about them. You know, speaking of your own kids, the guys you're training, obviously yep. a lot of up and comers. There's going to be future world champions there, Kev. Yeah. If you're if you're involved, look, it's going to be success. But tell us, who do we need to watch out for at the moment? Obviously, look at that guys coming up the ranks. I've got a good kid with me tonight. Um, he's, he's fighting the weekends with Jordan Leonard, a good middleweight. I think eventually he'll be a super middleweight. Um, he's in the gym sparring like of John Wilders, Felix Cashes, Connor Ben. He's only a kid, 20 years of age. He holds his own with everyone. and He's, um, he's a good learner, a good listener. He um, picks things up. Physically, he's the part. He's not even there yet physically. He's only a 20-year-old kid. Um, who knows where, where, the, where his career could go. I think he could go all the way if he gets it right. Um, but he's, he's a pleasure to train, and I think, yeah, keep your eye open for Jordan Lillard. I've got another little good little fighter called Maisie Rose. Um, she's near the butt the banner weight for the division. She's a good little fighter, little, good little learner. Multiple amateur champion. Um, yes, I've got a good little stable coming through. That's the main thing. And look, you love boxing, look, you're still heavily involved. Yeah. How much do you, do you miss the training, the aspect of actually being in the ring? Because look, you were a classy fighter, and unfortunate enough to be a world champion, which yeah. you should have been. But look, Things happen, it's the game. Obviously, you're still involved and you love it. Yeah, I love it. I don't miss it. Um, it's such an hard sport, such an hard, such an hard industry to um, get it right. And um, the training is so hard and the regimes are hard. And do you know what? Since the eight years I've retired now, it's even got harder. So I don't know, even know if I could even go st stand to the training that they do it now and, and keep to it. It's very hard. But um, You still look like a baby, by the way. You have an edge today, Kev. <laughs> it's like, I'm five kidding. years of age. <laughs> One of my girlmates said that the other day, I've like raised like a million years. But, um, you yeah, know, the, the sport's a very hard sport. And you know what? I had a good guy here. I had 43 free pro fights. I had 50 amateur fights. I never ducked anyone. I fought everyone. Um, for me now, I feel like being a coach was was for me. I think this was for me. That's why I didn't win the World Tower. I think there's reasons for, for everything. And for me, I love coaching young fighters and bringing them through now. So I'm really going to enjoy the next 10 years of my career producing good kids. We're lucky to have you still in the boxing game. Look, Matchroom obviously doing big things, Kevin. Obviously, look, yes. they're putting on a big show. And look, this, this care could have easily been cancelled. Obviously, the Callum Smith getting injured, they could yeah. have pulled it, but they haven't. They're looking after fighters. Uh, what's your thoughts on Kelly Taylor? Look, she's obviously iconic, a great female boxer, perhaps the greatest of all time. But look, talk she might fight Chantel Cameron. Obviously, there's the rematch. Uh, there's a lot of stuff in the pipeline. But what's your rate and how do you rate Kelly Taylor? Yeah, I love Kelly Taylor. She's such a lovely girl as well. I met her in Birmingham for the first time. She's such a nice kid. Um, Great fire, she's done wonders for women boxing. So I remember when I was a kid, women boxing wasn't really getting off the floor. I think I think she's from her and Eddie Hearn transformed women boxing massively. So you can thank Katie Taylor and Eddie Hearn for that. Um yeah, I think she's a great champion. And I think I wish you all the success in the world. She's just a nice girl. She's our champion should be. She's humble, lovely, polite, respectful, and she can fight. Last of all, look, Andy Joshua's back. I love to pick your brain. Yep. Can he make a successful return? Do you reckon, look, there's a lot more there for him still? Or, look, is the last two fights going to take that toll? You know, I love AJ. I've got a lot of respect for AJ. He's a good man. Um, an old friend of mine from the fighting game, from, from when he first turned professional and that. Um, I personally feel AJ, if I had got a chance to speak to AJ one-to-one, -one, I'd like to see him get back with Tony, get make amends with Tony. Yeah. I don't know speak. I just think he needs his old-school trainer back, and I don't think he's been as good as ever since he left us. But, um... Time will tell. I hope he's right and he's in a good place mentally. He's done unbelievable for the sport. Look what he's done. He's done what we all dreamed of and more. Um, can't take nothing away from him. He's a, he was a great fighter, great champion. He ain't just quick as soon as he's, been made, he's made comebacks. He's come back and revenged the feats. Yeah, he's a great, and he's just an all round great, great guy. He's a good man. I, I owe him a lot of respect to my family. I owe him a lot of respect. Yeah. Kev, it's an honour as always. It's great to see you here in Liverpool. We're looking forward to a massive weekend. I'm looking forward to seeing you train many world champions, my man. Thank you very much. Cheers, man. Be sure to check out and support all our media partners, Sports Matters.
bringing the sports home.